Hello everybody and welcome to this brand new series on the channel. When I first started this channel, I wanted it to be all Pokemon and Zelda. So, uh, we're bringing you this Wind Waker playthrough. Uh, because, honestly, uh, hold on, give me a second. Uh... Give me two seconds. Don't want no black bars and oh, there's a black bar covering my face now. But it doesn't matter. Look, boom. Ha! There we go. Anyways, so we're bringing, we're gonna be playing. So like I said, like I was saying before, I started uh, editing on the fly. When I first started the channel, I wanted it to be Pokemon and Zelda. There's a Minish Cap playthrough that's unfinished. Because it just pissed me off and I was like, I'm never playing this game again. Uh, hopefully it won't happen with Wind Waker. But, um, I mean, it could happen with Wind Waker, but I hope it doesn't. Um, but yeah, we're playing Wind Waker. This series is probably just going to go up on the weekends. Uh, because I'm going to be playing a, a, another Pokemon game now that... Blaze Black, Blaze Black is done. I don't know if it's already up or not. I'm not sure when Blaze Black is going to end and when this is going to start. Uh, but yeah. So, oh, you can capture. Hold on. Uh, there we go. Now you can't capture the cursor. Okay, I don't. I'm not capturing the cursor. Okay. So, uh, without further ado, let's click into the game screen and let's start a new game. Start. Let's call ourselves, what we usually call ourselves in Pokemon games, because that, let's just say that's become a thing for YouTube now. I'm going to call myself Settles no matter what game I play. Uh, now, today I have juice instead of water. It's crystal white. It was a bad idea because it's giving me extreme heartburn. But uh, this, this is but one of the legend. Long ago, there existed a kingdom where a golden power lay hidden. Can't start this. It was a prosperous land, blessed with green forests, tall mountains, and peace. But one day, a man of great evil found the p golden power and took it for himself. With its strength and his command, he spread darkness across the kingdom. But then, when all hope had died and the hour of doom seemed at hand, a young boy clothed, clothed in green appeared as if from nowhere. Wielding a blade of evil's bane, he sealed the dark one away and gave the land light. <laughs> this boy who traveled through the time to save the land was known as the Hero of Time. The boy's tale was passed down through generations until it became legend. But then, a day came when a, when a fell wind began to blow across the kingdom. The great evil that all thought had been forever sealed away by the hero. Once again crept forth from the depths of the, of the earth, eager to resume its dark design. The people believed that the hero of time would again, would again come to save them. But, the, dear, the, the, but the, the hero did not appear. Heartburn. Faced on by onslaught of evil, the people could not do anything but appeal to the gods. 
In their last hour, as doom drew nigh, they left their future in the hands of fate. Hand of fate is the Pokemon attack, a Digimon attack. From the anime? What became of that kingdom? None remain who know. The memory of the kingdom vanished, but its legend survived on the wind's breath. I get it, Wind Waker! Uh, Wind Waker is uh, on a certain island. It became customary to garb boys in green when they became, when they came of age. Clothed, clothed, clothed in the green of fields, they aspired to find heroic blades to cast and cast down evil. I'm sorry, I hit my desk. Keep hitting my desk. I'm hitting my desk right now. Just get a little excitement. The elders wished only for the youths to know courage, like the hero of legend. Is that it? Alright, so this is the first time I've ever played this game. It's the first time I've ever touched this game. I've seen the Game Grumps play it. That's about all I have. And is that how big it's going to be? Because if it is, I think I have to... Big Brother! Big Brother! Oi! Stop sleeping, Link. Big brother! Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Alright, Link. I knew you'd be here. Hee hee hee! This is my favorite spot to get out of the sea when I play with the gulls. I call it Arrow's Lookout. So, do you remember what day it is today? You are still half asleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Big Brother, it's your birthday! That's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. It's a good thing I came to find you. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? Yeah, I should. Alright, so let's just... Just look at this OBS. I opened paint, sorry. Okay, so... Yeah, this looks great. Right, this is Zelda. You can't jump in Zelda. Alright. I'm excited to play this game. I just got the dolphin emulator. Oh, that. Oh, that's that's not the right thing. That's that. No. I'm gonna have to fix that between episodes. But no, I can't. I can't do that. All right, the joystick turns to the wrong way. I just saw a wild, a wild pig. Ooh, see, look at that black one there. Don't you see him? This is perfect. My wife was just telling me how she really wanted a pet. You ready to grab it, Suttles? Now you can't just run up to it. Pigs are too alert about the surroundings f for you to just go, j just jog up and capture one. If you want to get close, you have to hold R to crouch and tilt to crawl slowly behind it. Slowly. You could also distract it with bait, I guess. is going to be Oh my god
There we go, I got it. I got your stupid pig. Oh, he said it was plus L right there and you just talk to me. Where is he? How am I supposed to talk to you? I can't even fucking look up at you. There we go. That's correct, you're a smart one. You may f you, my friend, have just used L targeting. You just L targeted me. You see, when you press L, you can target certain objects. I, for one, use it quite often to talk to folks or oh, shut up. So instead of Z targeting, it's L targeting. Got it. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do this right now. I can't continue playing this. <sighs> All right. Let's see what this does. It didn't change. This is. I'm gonna go in here. Which I know is my house. Okay, I can't fucking do this. Like, I'm using a I'm using a gamepad, uh, Xbox 360 controller to play this game, and um, like you see me just spinning around and turning. That's because of this. I've been waiting for you, Settles. Settles. Try these on. Time is certainly flies. I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. Uh, puke green. Why do I have to wear these, Grandma? Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. Today is a day to celebrate. It's a day that you become the same age as the young hero spoken of in all our legends. You only have to wear them for one day, so don't look so so don't look so down. Be proud, child. I, in the olden days, this was the day the. This was the day boys were finally considered to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the ways of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. Hanging in the, uh, hanging the family shield on a wall as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down for those, from those ages. So I just changed right there in front of my grandma while she was talking to me. Great. Does this all make sense to you? Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I was changing clothes. Clothes. Isn't that nice, Huddles? They, they suit you perfectly. A perfect fit. Well, tonight I'm going to invite the whole town over for your birthday party, so I'd like better get started. Better start getting ready, shouldn't I? Your grandma's going to make your favorite suit for you tonight. Hmm. I just know you're looking forward to it. Now go get your sister, Errol. Errol Dactyl. <laughs> Sorry. Let's go get Errol, Errol. I'm psyched to play this game. That bitch is waving at me. Wait, hold on. Hey, man, man. Yep. 
I can't get there, so. But I still got this 15 rupees. Oh my god, get away. No, 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 no. He just gave up. Good. This is going to be extremely difficult. I I have to find a way to switch the axis, to invert the axis. This is going to be so difficult to play this way. All right, right. Look, cut screen. Ah, holy big brother! Did Grandma make that outfit for you? But wow, you look like you'd be way too hot in those clothes. I guess they're pretty neat, though. So anyway, Suttles, can you close your eyes and hold out your hands just for a second? I'm going to give you my most treasured belonging, but just for one day. Happy birthday! I didn't close my eyes. Hey, she gave me the thing. So, well, do you like it? I'm letting you borrow this special gift just because you're my big brother. Aren't you lucky, hee hee hee. Oh, why don't you try it out right now? Try looking out over at our house from here. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Uh. That postman looks kind of weird, doesn't he? Oh, but I don't have a sword yet. <laughs> What's going on with my fucking hat? Uh, so such a, a delayed reaction. Oh, this is so terrible. That girl fell into the forest. She needs help. I saw that all with my eyes. I didn't need a telescope. But it's too dangerous for you to go in there without something you can use to defend yourself with. I will hit them with this telescope. Nope. Okay, seriously, this is gonna, this. There's no getting used to this. This is just horrible. No, no, get away, get away. So now you gotta go learn how to use a sword. I've seen people play this game, so I know like this uh, this beginning part. Oh, what's the matter, Subtles? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, the look on your face. I suspect it's not laughing matter. What matter? What do you say, Subtles? Ah, have you come for some serious research on the way of the sword? Yes, sir. Very good. Your first lessons will be 
A horizontal fight. Slice. Face me and press B. Wrong. Press only B. Oh, okay. Very good. Keep coming at me until you hear me say very good. Create a song while you fight. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Hold L targeting. Oh, that was that was A. Sorry. Very good. Next is the thrust. L target and tilt up and press B. Next is the spin attack. Hold B briefly, build up your strength. Uh, okay. Parry attack. Press L until you see A in it. Okay. Very good. Now finally the jump attack. Draw your sword, L target, and press A. There's a fine display. Alright, that's pretty simple. And yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold, an eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened. But I have faith in you. Somehow I doubt you will misuse that sword. You may have it, Settles. I give it to you freely. Take the blade with you. I got the blade! Since the olden days of blades and people desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong, Settles. Bye, gong. All right. This game is beautiful. The soundtrack is incredible. This little snot-nosed kid is annoying. I'm just gonna cut all the grass. Do my chores. Oh yeah. Twenty six. Oh man, I have a feeling that they're, they're gonna be. That when I play this game, it's gonna be like playing every other Zelda game, except that like they're gonna be like. These moments where I'm like so frustrated with the game that I don't want to play it anymore. But I have a feeling that overall I'm going to love this game. Did I kill the pig? No. Alright, let's go to the... Let's go to here. Let's go to here and do the shit. Let's go to here. What the fuck? What? Why is that there? Why is that a thing? No. Okay, seriously, this fucking joy other joystick is gonna be so annoying.
Okay, uh, also guys, uh, if you hadn't already noticed, this isn't the HD, this is the original GameCube version. I don't have a Wii U. Uh, plus, I'm playing this on emulator. I don't even know if there's a Wii U emulator, and if there is, I don't even think there's a ROM for this game. But, uh, or an ISO, sorry. But yeah. I'm basically this is like playing it on GameCube. And uh so it's like if I'm playing this game back in tw 2003. All right. So I actually got the the sword I remember seeing like two playthroughs of this where the people were like, I did the training, how do I get the sword? And then I got the sword on the first fucking try. <laughs> okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Let me just turn in circles for about half an hour. That sounds like a good episode. You guys want to watch that, right? Hey, a pig. Yeah. <sighs> I have to take you have to go up there. I have a feeling that I'm not supposed to be here. It's just like... No, I am supposed to be here. Because then these birds are gonna drop these other pigs. Oh no! Girl! Why am I acting like this game is new? Like, everybody knows that's Tetra and that Tetra is, uh... I'm not gonna say it in case someone has never played the game before and doesn't know. Well, what's with the get up? Well, whatever. So, Harry, where am I? Oh, that's right. That giant bird came in. Miss, Miss Tetra. Oh, oh, thank, thank goodness you're safe. When I saw you get dropped off on the summit, I thought for sure you'd... Summit? So that, so that bird dropped me on top of a mountain. Well, that wasn't nice of it. Well, don't just stand there. Let's go. Time to repay our debt to that bird in full. But miss, what about this boy? Don't worry about him, come on. Me too, I want to come along. Hi, hey, big brother! No! Like, he's a, he's a big idiot. Oh, stupid kid! Get a hold of yourself! She's gone! There's nothing you can do! The gulls are gonna save her. What? You wanna come with us on our ship? 
Do you understand what you're asking? We're pirates, you know, pirates! The terror of the sea! What do we get out of bringing some helpless little kid along with us? I'll tell you what we get. A headache. I know how much uh, you must feel with your sister having been kidnapped and all. But that doesn't really have anything to do with us. Now does it? And how do you figure that? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa there. Who just, who do you think you're you know, getting a conversation? Please tell me, all I say is that you have big bad pirates that didn't come to this garden island. That poor girl would have been snatched away by that bird. And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I will tell you. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time traveling amongst the I could see islands. There are many different islands in the Crusade Choir. I haven't heard any of uh, I haven't heard any of you. Haven't any of you heard? A word that young girls have been getting kidnapped lately from all the regions of the Great Sea. No matter whether you've heard it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours have been getting kidnapped never to be seen again. And unless my eyes fail me, the young girl who just kidnapped from this island also had long ears. Does she not? Rock? Much like you, Miss Fierce and Barrett. Rock? My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it grabbed her. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was your it was young Suttles here who saved you from the monsters in the forest, wasn't it? Is this true? Oh, and while I'm at it, I may as well tell you that the bird kidnapped both you and Suttles' sister has made its foul nest near the north on the heights of the Forsaken Fortress. The Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So what? What are you going to do? All right. Under the circumstances, I think it would, I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give Suttles a little help. Now would it? All right. Hmm. I don't need you to tell me that. Even if I were to consider it, lately I've heard nothing but evil rumors about this forsaken fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but that cheap little sword. It's not brave. It's stupid. I mean, come on. Even a simple little island like this has to have something you could use as a shield. You know, something to protect yourself with? Anything? Tell you what, if you come back with something like that, I'll let you stow away on our ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a while, so you'd better go say goodbye to your family while you have the chance. I don't want you getting all weepy-eyed and homesick on me. And with that, we're going to end off today's episode right here. If you guys like this, if you guys want to see more of this me playing Wind Waker, this beautiful layout that I made in about 15 minutes uh, and more of this face then hit the subscribe button because it's the only place you'll ever see this face um, aside from that like this video and comment whatever you want and uh, with that said I'm going to see you guys next time thanks for watching and bye bye <laughs>